I just recently seen the Paul Geis, uh the remake, and it sucks. Just to be quite honest. I rarely uh, see horrible movies, but I saw Taken on Paper Planes, so that counts. And let's get to, uh, hopefully this is a quick review, because I don't want to go too long about it. Let's get to the, uh, let's say, uh, go to the, go to immediately to the review. Now, let's go. Poltergeist remake is a uh, remake to the original version of the Poltergeist, and what to expect about this film? The remake? It sucks. Sorry about that. I had to jump out today because I went to demo mode. Well, uh, the film's good points. See why I'm, why I'm going uh, going slow on this? Because this movie sucked, so it's hard for me to figure it out before I'm try and trying to hold on to the big rant. Which I will probably gonna go. Ah, this movie sucks. <sighs> the movie is no good. And if you want to see it, see it with a friend to share your pain. And I went. I was supposed to see two of the two of my mates, and one didn't show because he knew and, uh, that that he didn't see a. Uh, and he won't like it, but this is what it ended up to. One. And that's what I give to this movie, which is a few. And I try not to swear as much as possible on this review because I do a lot of swearing on my channel. So I try to hold on to the swearing until I actually get the cons. Now let's get to the pros. Sam Rockwell in this film is, uh, is the only thing I could point to that is the only, he's the only thing good about it. He, like, he gives a crap. Uh, he only gives a, he's the only thing good about this movie, and I'm pretty much, uh, that's almost, uh, um, the other, the old guy, and, uh, it did have a clever, uh, opening, that, uh, not only clever few tricks they did in the film, but it completely sucked, it, it doesn't deserve your money, like, taking three, and paper planes. They're both free those movies as I mentioned. Don't see because uh they don't deserve your money. And I knew it was gonna suck and I should have listened to Rose reviews because I rarely watch anything that sucked. Now to the cons where I'm probably gonna be want to go to rage. Um The ghost effects look completely cheap. Like I was all too dark and I couldn't really uh, I, like, you could see that the monsters, like, I meant the ghost, is trying to do, like, the Babadook game, but I haven't seen the Babadook, which I should have saw first. And then watch this and tell it, it's saying to you, it's out of garbage. <sighs> yeah, um, it's basically a shot, shot, shot remake, and it is, because I saw a few clips of the original, and I saw this, and I went, it's a shot for shot remake. Why they did this? It, the cycle did it, and everyone hated it. And I imagine uh, they're not going to do this type of crap, um, this type of thing uh, in the future. I'm, I'm trying to hold out on my rage because I'm completely lost what the movie's trying to talk about. It's completely all over the place. <sighs> the, the rest of the cast have on the Sam Rockwell. Uh, they're all shit. Uh, they're all bad. I mean, like, they didn't do, they didn't, they just acted like generic characters, and all they had to do, recapture the magic of the original. But it didn't work. And I'm pretty sorry about this, uh, fans. And I know my videos are not that great in the last few, but I really, 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 really apologize for the, the video I made. Uh, of the top 10 uh, movies that everyone like uh, hates but I like. It's, how, it's just inspiration. And I didn't expect it to perform very poorly. Yeah, but I didn't expect that. I knew you can learn to watch it. Why do you love my movie reviews, like? Uh, right? Um, 
what I give this film, I don't want to go too long to detail. Uh, the film gets a uh, 2 out of 5, and if, if I will give it a 1, it will be garbage. This one is almost out of garbage. And if I give it a stuntman rating, as I will do now, I will give it a roll, uh, roll to my uh, right now. If it's an F, it's automatic 1. If it's D minus, it almost goes straight to 1. If it's D, it stays there. And D plus is what I give it. D plus, uh, 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 no satisfaction. And and I forgot to mention that this film uses jump scares. That is that is one reasons most people don't like uh, horror movies these days. They use cheap jump scares and it's been dying for a long time. And I fear it's going to be getting at the end is near. We need more films like The Babadook and The Co Conjuring that everyone likes. But anyway, guys, um, and A plus is an automatic 5 out of 5. And A minus A uh, gives it advance, and A just gives, me, gives it a near 5. A plus is an automatic 5, and an F is an automatic 1. If you've seen this film, which I probably think you didn't, let me know in the comments below so we ha actually talk about this movie and tell the movie film industry we're done with these type of movies and make more films like A Conjuring and The, Dark, uh, the Babadook. Anyway guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed this review and uh, see you guys next time and yeah, see ya.